clearly Wyatt Kelsey cannot believe her luck. Imagine being the coolest kid in preschool, not just because your dad is a famous football player, but because your Aunt Taylor is THE Taylor Swift. For Wyatt, it wasn't just that Taylor had joined their family, thanks to Uncle Travis, but the fact that she now had front row access to her very own pop star hero. And the best part? Wyatt isn't shy about letting everyone know just how enchanted she was by her Aunt Taylor. Just like Wyatt, Fans all over have been captivated watching the love between Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey blossom. What started as a one-sided crush has turned into something real and deep, with fans cheering from the sidelines. And despite the whispers and wild rumors that have swirled around their relationship, Travis and Taylor are proving the naysayers wrong, showing the world that their connection is far from just a PR stunt. So y'all know how a few months ago, the rumor mill was working overtime, spreading some truly vicious gossip. People started claiming that Taylor and Travis's relationship wasn't real and that it was nothing but a fake romance cooked up to help boost Travis's public image and bring more attention to the NFL. Are Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey really broken up? Well, we have a new statement from Travis which really settles the debate. As you guys know, recently a supposed document leaked from Travis's PR agency stating that this relationship is a contractual publicity stunt and was set to expire on September 28th. And as luck would have it, Taylor Swift opted not to jet off to Los Angeles to watch Travis Kelsey play for the Kansas City Chiefs for the second week running, allowing him to concentrate on his game amidst a slump in performance. Or so we think. Honestly, anybody can put a logo on a document and print it out, take a picture of it and say that it's the real deal. Do I think that this is a PR relationship? Yes, I think to some degree it is, but I think that there are actually real feelings involved between these two. But what is it that Travis had to say about Taylor's absence from his games? He said, if you're dating a professional athlete, I do not believe, at least for me, that you need to go to all of the games. It is also being said that Travis's performance in the two games that Taylor missed has been really exceptional. So maybe not having the pressure of his superstar girlfriend there is really helping him play better. Anyway, what do you guys think? Do you think this is a publicity stunt relationship or is this the real deal? Can you imagine people saying that Taylor Swift, dick of all people, needed to fake a relationship for clout? It got so wild that fans and critics alike began dissecting every little thing trying to find proof that it was all staged. They said Taylor was just doing her part to help Travis and his football team get more press. Like, seriously? But here's the thing. None of it was true. None! Both Taylor and Travis's camps have come forward to clear the air and shut down the rumors. They called the gossip what it was, complete lies. Honestly, it wasn't the first time people tried to stir the pot with fake stories about them, and it probably won't be the last. Nasty rumors have been swirling ever since the two started dating. People have even tried to claim that Travis was cheating, but again, zero proof and all the allegations were quickly debunked. At this point, it's like people are just waiting for something to go wrong. But guess what? Travis and Taylor are too busy being madly in love to care. Let's be real for a sec, the chemistry between these two is everything. You can just tell how much they adore each other. It's not just a show for the cameras kind of thing, it's the real deal. They're always caught being super cute and affectionate, and it's honestly hard not to root for them. Every time they are seen together, you just feel like they're the type of couple that's really into each other in all the best ways. Remember the 2024 US Open in New York? Are Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey really broken up? Well, we have a new statement from Travis which really settles the debate. As you guys know, recently a supposed document leaked from Travis's PR agency stating that this relationship is a contractual publicity stunt and was set to expire on September 28th. And as luck would have it, Taylor Swift opted not to jet off to Los Angeles to watch Travis Kelsey play for the Kansas City Chiefs for the second week running, allowing him to concentrate on his game amidst a slump in performance. Or so we think. Honestly, anybody can put a logo on a document and print it out, take a picture of it and say that it's the real deal. Do I think that this is a PR relationship? Yes, I think to some degree it is, but I think that there are actually real feelings involved between these two. But what is it that Travis had to say about Taylor's absence from his games? He said, if you're dating a professional athlete, I do not believe, at least for me, that you need to go to all of the games. 
It is also being said that Travis's performance in the two games that Taylor missed has been really exceptional. So maybe not having the pressure of his superstar girlfriend there is really helping him play better. Anyway, what do you guys think? Do you think this is a publicity stunt relationship or is this the real deal? <laughs> Yeah, that was a moment. The Grammy queen and the Kansas City Chiefs star were spotted in the stands, fully into the game. And while the world was watching Taylor Fritz take on Janik Sinner in the men's singles final, all eyes were also on Taylor and Travis. And let's just say, they didn't disappoint. Travis was caught planting the sweetest kiss on Taylor's head, and the two were seen singing, dancing, and just having the best time together. It was the kind of moment that melts your heart and makes you think, okay, these two are really into each other. And it's not just about the cute moments in public. Taylor joined Travis for the Chiefs' first game of the 2024-25 season, and the PDA was out of control in the best way. From the sideline cheering to the hand-holding and kissing after the game, it was obvious that Taylor Taylor and Travis are that couple who can't keep their hands off each other. Fans totally ate it up, and it was just another reminder of how much fun they have together. Then there was that wedding date. Major power couple energy here. So Taylor and Travis attended model Karen Elson's wedding to Electric Lady Studios owner Lee Foster in New York City. Security, please, 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 please don't block, please. Wow, Taylor. Taylor. Beautiful, Taylor. Beautiful. Taylor. Beautiful. Taylor. 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 And we know weddings are always a hot topic when it comes to celebrity couples. And naturally, people are wondering when it will be their turn. Of course, rumors are flying that they might already be engaged, but until Taylor or Travis makes an official announcement, it's all just speculation. Still, the wedding buzz has everyone thinking, could they be next? But it's not all public events and wedding talks. These two know how to keep it low-key, too. Their late-night dinner dates are still very much a thing. They were recently spotted on a double date with Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds in NYC, looking absolutely stunning. Taylor, as always, brought her A-game in fashion, rocking a chic Gucci net corset with navy blue lace detail, a black leather skirt, and those killer Louis Vuitton Roxy ankle boots. Oh, and she topped it off with a polo Ralph Lauren coat and camel, a Dior saddlebag, and jewelry from La Dolce Vita, Giovanni, and Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Honestly, she was serving all the looks. Everyone who's seen them together can't stop talking about how perfect they are for each other. From their friends to their families, it's clear that the people closest to them fully support their relationship. Travis's family has been super open about how much they love Taylor, and Taylor's circle is just as excited for her. Because honestly, Taylor fits right in with the Kelsey crew like she's always been there. Travis's nieces, Wyatt and Ellie, are absolutely obsessed with her. It's like they hit the jackpot having Aunt Taylor in their lives. Wyatt, in particular, is always talking about Taylor, and Taylor loves loves being around them just as much. She's always down to hang with the girls, playing along with their games and showing off those cool ant vibes. It's honestly the sweetest thing ever to see how much they adore each other. Taylor's got that playful, fun energy that makes her the perfect person to be around kids 
and the girls are totally living for it. And it's not just the children. Taylor has been getting along so well with the whole Kelsey squad. She's bonded with Jason Kelsey and his wife Kylie in a way that makes it feel like they're just one big happy family. The fact that Jason and Kylie's kids are super cool with Taylor has only made the connection between Taylor and Jason's family even stronger. I couldn't help but notice. I couldn't help but notice. Since it was all over the broadcast, and I was pre-warned that this was going to happen, um, the internet broke, social media broke, every news network in the uh, in the world covered it, every podcast, and uh, obviously our own personal text and mentions. You had a special guest watching the game uh, in the Travis Kelsey suite, which, by the way could not have been up to the fire code there were way too many people in that suite first of all jason don't be don't do that all right our suite is regulated and safe okay that was packed to the rafters how's it feel that uh taylor swift has finally put you on the map <laughs> shout out to taylor for uh for pulling up that was pretty ballsy that was pretty ballsy yeah <laughs> i um i just thought it was awesome how everybody in the suite had nothing but great things to say about her you know the the friends or family she looked amazing everybody was talking about her in a in great light and on top of that uh you know the let's talk about donna and ed kelsey travis's parents are beyond thrilled with taylor they can't say enough good things about her. To them, Taylor is already part of the family. They've both mentioned how happy they are that Travis is dating someone who genuinely makes him happy. And honestly, what more could parents want? They are just excited to see their son with someone who brings out the best in him. And it's clear they can't wait for the day when Taylor becomes an official member of the Kelsey family. To Donna and Ed, it feels like it's only a matter of time before that wedding bell rumor becomes a reality. Taylor's parents are all in on her relationship with Travis too. After all the ups and downs, they're just relieved to see their daughter's heart finally healed and loving again. Let's be real, Taylor's had her share of heartbreaks, and it hasn't been easy watching her go through it. But now, with Travis by her side, it's like her heart is glowing again, and her parents couldn't be happier. They can totally see how much she's thriving in this relationship, and they're here for it. Taylor's dad and Travis? Literal besties. These two hit it off right from the start, and now they're practically inseparable whenever they get together. Whether they are watching games or just hanging out, it's clear that Taylor's dad has fully embraced Travis as one of his own. And Taylor's mom? She adores Travis. She's always doting on him, making sure he's comfortable, and just treating him like part of the family. It's all good vibes, and you can tell that her parents are so thankful that their daughter is with someone who genuinely cares for her. They've seen Taylor through all the highs and lows, and no that she's finally found someone who makes her happy has to feel like a big win for them too. In the end, whether they are crushing it at a football game, dancing at a wedding, or chilling on a double date, Travis and Taylor just work. They are the couple everyone wants to be and the romance everyone's rooting for. It's been a wild ride with rumors and fake news trying to bring them down, but if their recent moments are anything to go by, they are stronger than ever. And if we are being honest, it's just cute to see how they are proving all the haters wrong one adorable moment at a time. So guys, what do you think is next for Travis and Taylor? A baby? More PDA moments? Or maybe a ring on that finger? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you don't want to miss out on the hottest celebrity news, make sure to subscribe to Pop Plug.